We need to find out how much we would need to invest today to meet our goal of $250,000 44 years from now. So we're looking for a single lump sum today, that is, we're looking for the present value. We know the future value, $250,000, but what do we put in for the number of periods and for the interest rate? Well, there's a couple of ways that we can do this, but if we use 44 for the number of periods, then we're assuming that each period is a year, since there's 44 years. Remember, we have to match the interest rate with our periods. So, since our periods are in years, we have to find the effective annual interest rate. Our calculator can do this pretty easily. We just need to tell it the nominal interest rate and the periods per year that our interest is compounded. Our nominal interest rate is given as 12%, so enter this as the nominal percentage. The question tells us that the interest is compounded weekly, so our periods per year must be 52, so we enter that under periods per year. Now our calculator will do the rest. Just press effective percentage to solve for the effective annual interest rate, and we get 12.734%. Now we have all the information we need to solve for the present value. Before we enter the following in the calculator, remember to turn your calculator back to one period per year, since we're going to be putting 44 periods, and a period is a year, in for n. So put 44 in for n after you've done that. Put in 12.734% for the interest per year, which we found out in the last part. And put in $250,000 as the future value. Solving for the present value, we find the lump sum we would need to invest today to end up with $250,000 44 years from now to be $1,280.88.